This week, we're celebrating Bob Marley's birthday. Six-time Grammy winner Phineas stops by to talk American cliche. And who is Sherry Curry calling out in rock and roll oblivion? Oh, Phineas is on today's show. Nice. Hey, everyone, I'm Katie Darrell, and this is the Music High Five. We've got a lot of music news to cover, but first, let's go ahead and do the quick hits. Miley Cyrus proposed to be the singer at Gwen and Blake's wedding. Billie Eilish is drumming up anticipation for her new documentary, The World's a Little Blurry, by dropping a new trailer to much fanfare. The weekend has officially set dates for his After Hours World Tour, which will be starting January 14th, 2022. Well, we powered through those quick hits. Let's get to some interviews and the music high five. Number one. Phineas delivers American cliche. I'm an American cliche. Producer and musician extraordinaire, Phineas has a new single out today, and as a little treat, he stopped by to chat with yours truly. Tell me about the song American Cliche. I can, yeah. It was a song that I wrote, uh, the hook of at least, in the summer of 2017. And um, I played it at like a couple shows that year, like really early, early shows in my career. And somebody at one of those shows like put the live video of me doing that song on YouTube. And for the last three and a half, four years, it's like haunted me in Twitter comments and YouTube comments, I'm like release American cliche. And I'm like, how do you even know that song? Um, but I, I like to give the people what they want. So I, I was like, let me work on that. Let me record it. I'll rewrite the verses because I've it's been four years. And, uh, but ultimately, it was a super fun song to work on. And um, that's the backstory. Number two, happy birthday, Bob Marley. In celebration of Bob Marley's 76th birthday, the Marley family will be hosting a global virtual event on February 6th. The worldwide celebration, under the theme Survival, will feature festivities like messages and performances from the Marley family, story readings, and tributes from fellow musicians. The special event can be watched on Bob Marley's official YouTube channel. Number three, celebrating Black History Month on Access TV. This February, Access TV will air content every Saturday night from 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. Eastern that highlights musical legends. Check out features from hip hop legends like Run DMC and Ice Cube, female icons like Tina Turner and Patti LaBelle, and get on up with Prince and James Brown. It all kicks off this Saturday, February 6th with a celebration of Motown legends. Number four, anniversary alert for Three Doors Down. Three Doors Down released their album, The Better Life, 20 years ago. And it's now time to celebrate with the box set. And I got to talk to lead singer Brad Arnold all about it. It's been 20 years since the release of Three Doors Down's The Better Life. What's changed in the 20 years? I got a few more wrinkles, uh, been a few more miles, oh, I'm a little older. I don't know, a lot, a lot of stuff. Life's still good though. There's a box set we need to talk about. Tell me all the details. Yeah, it has the uh, first record remastered in it. It has the songs from the demo that actually got us signed and uh, a whole lot more stuff in this. There's the demo uh, sessions. I mean, are these things that have never been released? People have never heard these before. Um, not like, not like this. Are they um, good, Brad? <laughs> most of them are okay. There's, there's one or two that I'm like, why? You know, there's a reason this wasn't on our first record, but we're, we're still releasing this, right? But it's cool to let people hear the kind of things that that didn't necessarily make it. For information on the box set and the pay-per-view concerts, make sure you check out threedoorsdown.com. Number five. Marilyn Manson dropped. Marilyn Manson has been dropped by his label, his agency, and several TV shows. They state they will no longer work with Manson as news broke that he is facing abuse claims from Evan Rachel Wood and four other women. All right, friends, before we wrap up the show, let's check out some super sweet new music videos. The Weather Station releases the music video for Parking Lot off the new album, Ignorance. And 70s icon and ex-Runaways lead singer Sherry Curry has released a brand new video for Rock and Roll Oblivion. Long lost friends in a rock and roll oblivion. Music news is always happening, so keep listening. I'm Katie Darrell, and that's the Music High Five. Hey there, thanks for watching Access TV. Subscribe, follow, like, and do all the good stuff. And make sure you leave a comment below. 
I don't know, just let us know what your favorite Access TV show is or who your favorite bands are and what artists you're into or just say hi, man. I like to be told hi. We love hearing from you. That's the point, all right? Keep it coming.